Hey Lavish fam, welcome back to the channel. Today is Friday and as you can see I am sitting in the office. I literally just got home from um, seeing a client, uh, hence the reason I'm still in scrubs. But anyway, it's time to start on Dante's man cave. <laughs> um, Dante works nights so he sleeps pretty much throughout the day. Um, so he doesn't get much done um, during the week, but it's Friday. He's off today. So I'm going to show you what the man cave looks like right now because that's where all of his stuff went when he when they, um, the movers came. So I'm going to show you what it looks like and then we'll talk about project number one. So oh please. <laughs> Okay, guys, brace yourself. This is the man cave. Yeah. So, <laughs> now that you see what it's looking like, Let's go back downstairs and talk. <laughs> um, so this weekend, Dante will be working on clearing it out. Um, but we're not a hundred percent on, I mean, it's not my space. It's not my space. He knows what he wants, but I guess I'm not really following his his vision. <laughs> so um I but one thing we do agree on is um a bar area. So you know, him to have a beverage bar center area. Um so that's where I come in at. I know he wants like I said a beverage area and I know he wants floating shelves or shelves above it. So, that's something I can definitely take care of. Um, because I, 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 I kind of, he kind of lets me make up my own vision of that. So, I bought some wood. And I am going to start on his bar area. Because I think Dante wants to paint this room all black. All black. Every wall, black. Once again, it's not my space. And that's what he wants to do. That's what we're going to do. Because he deserves to have a space that's his. So um, he's sleeping. But I'm going to change clothes. And then I'm going to go to the garage. And I'm going to start on this bar cart. Or cabinet. Bar cabinet. And... Um, yeah, that's what we're going to do. And then when he's up, we'll discuss it again. But for now, let me change clothes so I can get started. Okay, so fun fact. I ain't never built no cabinet. <laughs> um, so I watched a few YouTubes and um, I sketched out what I want, the, want it to look like. Can you see it? There we go. That's what I want it to look like. See, I, I, you know, so I got an idea of where I'm trying to go with this, but I ain't never did it before. So, um, nothing beats a failure but a try. So I'm about to see if I know what I'm doing, at least get started, and then I will come back um, and check in with you guys in just a bit. Cause ain't no need for y'all to see me over here struggling. <laughs> so I'll be back in just a bit. I know it's gonna 
okay so what i just did was make what's called a kick plate it's literally the space under the cabinet that little bit that you can actually like when you walk up to the cabinet where your toes or whatever feet goes into that little groove area so it's called a kick plate i learned that recently um so i just actually cut out the little spaces for the kick plate yeah and then once i figure out um the height that i want it to be i'm going to start putting in my um i'm gonna cut off the top of course and then i will um start doing my pocket pocket holes so that um my nails will be um hidden so Okay, so I decided to go with 42 inches um, high or tall. Um, my kick plate is three and a half inches. Um, so yeah, and it'll be 48 inches wide. Yeah, 42 height, 48 width. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, 24 in depth. I can't figure out where my noise canceling headphones are. So these are Dante work ones. <laughs> they do the job. They just look crazy. So yeah, let me go to the next part, which is just putting in my, um, my pocket holes. Yesterday, I did not do a, a, a lot of vlogging while I was while I was making that cabinet um, because I don't I, I was struggling a bit. <laughs> um, I'm a little rusty, um, and I don't know. I just kind of was just trying to get further in the process um, because. 
I want to get it like at least somewhat done by Sunday. Um, but I, I'm going to cook some breakfast and then I'm going to show you all what it looks like thus far. Um, I'm not going to make a lot of progress on it probably today because my subdivision is hosting um, like Halloween for the kids. And I'm part of the planning and the decorating and hosting. And my neighbors are coming over at like one. So, um, and so that means I need to get dressed. And I'm part to them coming. So anyway, um, I'll, I'm gonna cook some breakfast and then I'll show you guys what it looks like. And then I'll see if I'm gonna make any progress this morning. And best friend's on his way over here. So I don't know how this gonna go. <laughs> So we'll see, I'll be back. Okay, so this is what the cabinet is looking like thus far. Um, it is laying on this, the back. We will land down versus sitting up. Um, I need to do so, I need to flip it. Um, now I didn't even touch that, so that's a little weird. But anyway, um, what I'm learning is to stop buying <laughs> wood so far in advance because when the elements change outside and me leaving this wood in my garage, things like this happen. Let me see if y'all can see the difference. Let me see. I don't know if y'all can see it. But either way, this wood is not straight anymore, so it's not usable. So it was a waste of money because I waited to use it. But anyway, um, the plywood is fine, but regular wood, not so much. So that's where I'm at with the process. Um, I need to now just uh, flip it over, put some supports on it, and then some face uh, face yeah. face plates. I think it's called. I don't know if that's the correct term, but it's these things here. I'm thinking I want to put on there, and this side would have a shelf. So um, yeah, let me see where I'm gonna get with this, and then. Um, or if I'm gonna get anywhere. <laughs> but that's the plan for today. I have a couple hours before my neighbors come over. Um, yeah, so let's see. Y'all look at the cutest little Woody. You say hi? Hi. What you got? It's a person. Why you know so nasty? Why you so nasty? Oh. Okay, so let me give y'all an update of where I'm at. This is the progress so far. Look! They put sheep naked back. It's cold outside. So, yeah, I'm pretty excited about how it's coming along. Um, I still need to, of course, put a shelf in there, and then I need to put a front plate on there. Um, and then I think we're going to move it upstairs to the space, um, and I'll paint it there because Dante is, hold on, let me turn you around. So, yes, he's serious about the black paint, so this is going to be black, but I've ordered, um, what is it called? Contact paper to kind of go on the top and then on the shelf to kind of spruce it up and not just be completely black but you'll see that it's coming tomorrow I ordered it from Amazon um, so I'm gonna put the front plate on I think and the hooks for the shelves and then I think I'm gonna like I said we'll probably move it upstairs to the room so you'll see it in a bit when I'm all done y'all I'm I know I'm looking rough but but the cabinet is done. Other than caulking, painting, and all of that type of stuff, it is done. <laughs> I 
I'm proud of myself um, for sticking in there, first of all, and even getting to this point. You know what? Y'all probably like, stop talking, let us see it. Okay, so I'm going to let y'all see it. I'm going to let y'all see it. This is the cabinet. Hold on. Let me get a better angle. Hold on. This is what it looks like. I do have covers for the nails. Um, as you can see, here's one here. I was just making sure that they fit. And this will be black, so yeah. Something will be here. And then Dante only wanted one shelf because he's planning, I think, to put. Are you putting your record player in here? Yeah. So yeah, so anyway, that's the plan. I am so proud of myself. Oh my goodness, so yeah. Um, we just need to move it upstairs, but for now, I am going to straighten up this garage. Dante is mounting the TV in the living room. Um, yeah, so we just need to move it upstairs, but for now, I am going to straighten up my mess and uh, get dressed because we'll take a shower and get dressed because my neighbors will be over shortly, but I got something else to show y'all, so I'll be back. Hey y'all, so Dante is over here working to get this TV up. I don't think I told y'all, I don't know if I did. We did finally order some chairs for the living room. Um, the problem is, it's gonna take about a month for them to come. <laughs> so they won't be here until like Thanksgiving or like, uh oh, hold on. Yeah, so they won't be here until like Thanksgiving, but that's okay because slow and steady wins the race. Um, so we're just kind of gonna, we're not gonna be here for Thanksgiving anyway. Um, we're not hosting anything, we're going on vacation. So, yeah. Um, so let me show you what we're up to. Okay, so my neighbors were over because we're having a Halloween or whatever thing for the kids. So we've been blowing balloons. We have cupcakes, um, cookies, bunch of candy down there. Um, but yeah, so this is, he's putting the hook thingies or whatever on the back. And then he mounted the thing up there. And we have the one that's on the swivel so it'll pull out and swivel to whichever area you're sitting in or whatever but yeah so he's just doing that and then let y'all see what's going on out there so we have a bouncy house for the kids and then some little kid tables um and then an adult table we just got to put the chairs out there and we're going to have a runway for the kids to like show off their costumes yeah, so it's gonna be a whole little vibe. Too bad it's cold outside today. So I got on the coat because I've been outside. So I'll be back to show you what it looks like once we get it all mounted. Okay, okay, so the TV is up. <laughs> it is a little hot. Please do not comment telling me to move the TV because Dante said he ain't moving it. Um, we already know it's high. He said he ain't moving it. So it is what it is. It's at this point, it's going to stay right there. Um, <laughs> Room for decoration, that's why I did it. He said what? Room for decoration, that's why I did it. Oh, okay. So he's saying that he got this, this big space and put it that high because it's for my decorations. But anyway, it's up and it's going to be this way until he decides he's going to change it. So... <laughs> All right, <laughs> I'll be back. Look who naked. Huh? Because what? what he ain't going to do is wear no clothes. Right? No. <laughs> I don't like you. You don't like me? Uh oh, she don't like me. No, he don't. Yes, he do. No, he don't. Yes, he do. Whatever. No, what? Good morning, guys. Uh, today is Sunday. Sunday um, so I am up I just came back from Walmart um, Dante and I decided to bring the 
cabinet in the house because it's raining today. So um, I'm gonna stain it and paint, probably stain it and then we'll take it upstairs because he's upstairs now working in the man cave. Um, but I'm gonna stain it in the house because we had to, in order to bring it in, we had to go through the front door. So we had to go out the garage and come through the front door because the angle just wouldn't work in the garage. So that's why we brought it in for me to stain it and stuff. So that's the plan. And then I noticed that our TV and our master bedroom is probably going to be going out soon because of some of the things that it's just doing, like glitching and stuff. So while I was at Walmart, they had a TV on sale. Bam. <laughs> so I was like, Dante, we got to get it. We got to get it. So that's what we did. And of course, y'all, don't come for me in the comments. I bought another <laughs> paint roller and set of whatever because I don't be wanting to clean them. I know that is just lazy. Sometimes I clean them and sometimes I don't. Most of the time I don't. I'll keep the handles, but these things I just never do. And then I buy these little flimsy, like one time use, like um, pans. So I can just toss it. Like, I'm always doing stuff. I don't have time for that. I'm, I'm lying. That's just lazy. But, um, but yeah, so what I'm about to do, I'm going to go ahead and stain the cabinet. And then we'll move it upstairs to the space. So I'll be back because you guys know what staining looks like. So. Newsflash. I was wrong. I'm not staining. I am priming. 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 Not staining. But I'm sure some of y'all are in a, like thinking right now, what is she talking about? No, no. I am staying. I'm priming. Priming. Gosh. Priming. I'll be back. <laughs> guys so I know y'all saw me using spray paint on the inside walls of um, the cabinet so y'all know I'm painting it black and I have like probably 10 or more cans of black spray paint and I don't know what made me think about a certain youtuber who painted their vehicle with spray paint but it popped into my head and I was like, I'm going to cut back on some painting time. I'm still going to paint the outside of it with like regular paint. But I was just like, let me just go ahead and spray paint the inside and it worked. So, um, yeah. <laughs> so Dante and I have moved it upstairs to the room to see how it's going to look. And um, he changed the location where he wants it to sit. Once again, this is his space. And whatever he wants in his space is what he's going to have in his space. So um, I'm going to show you that in just a second. But this vlog is sponsored by Fashion Kicks. Fashion Kicks is also a China-based um, online store that sells um, replicas of high-end fashion shoes purses um yeah all of those things so they um sent me two items for my review 
And the first one is this is Gucci. I swear Dante don't cough until he until I turn this camera on. I swear. But anyway. <laughs> it's some sue strings. A Gucci bag, like a gift bag. Um just this. And then this is a um some dust a dust bag, two dust bags. Um the receipt. A envelope, envelope, as if you know you're gifting this. So this is what it looks like, and then there's these Gucci sneakers. Also, they sent me two pair of um, shoestrings. I thought maybe it must have not been, but this is what they look like. says Gucci on the back so that's that's them and then they also sent me um, sent me a purse so it comes in plastic and a dust bag. Oh, this is cute. So this is it. It's a Gucci purse with the this gray because I don't have any gray purses. And then it has the silver handle. So that's it. Nice crossbody, long, which I love crossbodies. When I had um, small kids, I used to always carry really big purses because I always felt like I needed to carry everything in there. And then as I got older and the kids got older, then I realized that crossbodies are like the way to go for me. So this is what it looks like. And all of this information will be linked down below if you guys are interested. So, thank you Fashion Kicks for sending me these items. I totally appreciate it. And I love them. So, thank you so much. So, let me show you guys what the um, cabinet looks like in that space. So, hope please. This right here is why I hate moving. I hate moving because this stuff right here, there is no place in the, You have to like, unless you have a place that you can go and dump this stuff, this stuff does not fit in your garbage on one weekly pickup. So, anyway, let's go upstairs. Okay, so... This is the room, and at first, originally, I thought we were going to put the bar over there, and then the floating shelves up, the, or the shelves up there, but, um, Dante has decided he wants it right here. So, it's now sitting here. When you first walk in the door... The shelf is not in there, um, it's downstairs. I still need to put that back in there. Um, so yeah, it's now sitting here instead. Um, and there's still boxes in here. He says that once I'm finished painting or we're finished painting, which most likely will be me because Dante's back to work tomorrow, um, then all these things will be unpacked and moved so um, he's waiting for me to finish the painting so that um, he can unpack this stuff so so anyway my morning is free tomorrow um, I have a doctor's appointment I think at like 
two or so. So most likely what I'll start doing is taping off the room um, in the morning. And then I'll probably start painting tomorrow. And I'm also, like I said, going to paint this bar cart. The reason I did not prime the top is because I plan to put contact paper on the top of the bar cart as well as the um, or cabinet, bar cabinet, or whatever. <laughs> I don't know what to call it, the cabinet. And I also plan to put it on the, the shelf um, as well. So Dante also did not want a door to it so there is no door which is fine because it's not my space um, but anyway yeah so we'll do that tomorrow and um, we'll at least get started tomorrow but for now I think I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog so I can get it edited and put out tonight and then I will um, start on the next one tomorrow when I start painting so I'm excited to see what this room is going to look like um all black all right so guys i will see you guys in the next one have a good day bye